Hey, Turtle Club. Good morning, guys. It is 8 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. It's time for Supporter Saturday, which is Pokemon... Wait, no, not actually Pokemon Quest. It was one of the things that could have won, but... We had an overwhelming landslide victory, guys. We had, um, well... <laughs> Pokemon Quest is not what won at all. What we did have win, though. And I think most of you guys are going to be really, really stoked about this. Really, really stoked about this. Come on. You know when you want to show up here. You know you want to show up here. There we go. There we go. Guys, look at that. Look at that beautiful, beautiful picture. It is Breath of the Wild Master Mode continuation all this month on Supporter Saturday. Hey, it's been a while. Hey, Triangle, how's it going, man? I just went to you, China. Oh, well, China blocking YouTube is not a not a, an unknown thing. Destro Kid, um, I do remember you. Vaguely. Um, my memory's not what it used to be. That's, you know, kind of the ongoing thing with us. But yeah, I know I gave some of you out there, Turtle Club, a little bit of a wait, what's going on kind of moment. But yes, guys, it is Master Mode, the Three Heart Challenge Redo. You change your shift at the charity shop so you can watch this stream. <laughs> Opponents, all right, all right. So here we are, Great Plateau. All kitted out. And we had the Great Plateau challenge kind of pop up. With that wonderful, horrible tuning fork thing. But it's not really what we're going to do. First off, let, let's, let's cut to the chase. We have so many things here. So many things that are just straight up not done right. Um... But we are continuing on, and part of continuing on is we are going to be breaking out of the Three Heart Challenge per se. And what I mean by that is we are actually going to gather these hearts up. Um, I'm going to make sure, because I was told last time, and guys, this save file is from January the 20th. That's almost like six months six months ago guys last time we touched this game i gotta actually read some of the tips here it's just that hey sue how's it going a game better than skyrim it depends upon who you ask all right so cool uh, from what we were told back in january of all things these hearts can be obtained uh, so we are going to travel down to here. So we're going to teleport over here to the, the Champion's Battle of the Little Shrine over here. Oh, that's an open adventure log. That's just a quest location. All right, so we're going to port over here. And we're going to actually kind of... We're going to make our way to the village. So where our house is, which we don't have yet. So we can actually get the shrine. So we can start converting some of these extra hearts that we're going to be picking up into stamina. So we're going to try to keep with the three heart challenge, but we do have four hearts that we got to kind of cash out pretty quick. And guys, that's uh, we, we're going to start picking up shrines. We're going to do everything we can. Uh, that's, that's our main focal point is to get these hearts converted into stamina. So we're not going to have as rough a go of it as we did when we took on this challenge originally and basically kicked... Ganon out of Hyrule. Um, oh, some things just never, never go away from your muscle memory. I'm like, how do I run? My body's already like, well, Mag, you push this button to run. I'm like, all right, all right. How many streams will we get? Well, it is going to be all this month. And so this is the second Saturday for this month. And I want to say we get four Saturdays total. 
So we'll get four streams, maybe three streams. Let me let me do let me go to the math. We're going to get three streams of Breath of the Wild for this month. Of course, the thing with Supporter Saturday is every beginning of the month, our supporters get to choose again. So wait for our stamina to build back up. Kind of judge where we're at in the, the map. We want to get to like right here ish. Let's see here. Give or take. Hey, Alexander Tamame, how's it going? I don't know if we're going to have all the stamina we need to cross this chasm or not. I think we will. I think we will. But yeah, guys, we uh, we made a mess of this map, and it's not going to be uh, too much of a problem because I do remember sort of, kind of where we're at, right? And uh, so so it'll it won't be too horrible. I do know that we absolutely have to go toward this red dot though, and this red dot's going to be pretty much where we can get to that shrine, so we can do some real quick fast travel. Some quick uh, snatch and grab kind of stuff. All right. Make it a real challenge and remove Majora's Mask. <laughs> oh, Sue. Um, no. <laughs> I, uh, you know, getting the mask was very important for part of this. Uh, we, we will absolutely, you know, not be using it for certain things. And, you know, like the Trial of the Sword, we won't be using it because we're going to do 100% everything again. Um, and that, as you all know, uh, every time we pick up the save, let me let me restate that that way. Every time we pick up the save, we will be uh, working toward 100% completion of everything, just like we did on the normal playthrough. Now, there was a, a series for a little bit that we tried called the Grateful Toad Challenge. Uh but this was actually what people were voting on, so we 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 took this up. We're just doing a little cross country travel. All right. But yeah, Sue, I uh, especially having not touched this game in six months, uh, that that wouldn't be a challenge. That would be a uh, an exercise in futility at the moment. But as I get more and more comfortable with the controls again, and get more and more back into the, the swing of things. I have no doubt that we'll be going back to that. Like case in point, things that I forgot. Ravioli's Gale. Let's just do that real quick. Why why climb when we can fly, right? These are these are facts that we've forgotten how to do things. We may have to have Nightbot tell us once again to use our boss's fury. It's just been that long. It's just been that long, guys. I do remember the goat assassins. And they, they clearly are still trying to come after me. Secret agents of Ganon, the goat assassin. That little pass there is just horrible to try to traverse. Don't forget the Hestu dance. Oh, trust me, opponents. I'm ready for that. That's the one thing I'm ready for. And in, in little less than... 50 minutes, guys. Oh, here comes the Yiga. Where is he? Oh, that's not good. There we go. All right, all right. I almost had a death. I almost had a death. Need some of those all important bananas. Boy, bananas don't heal me anywhere near as much as I remember them doing. Hey, Lou. 
Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, feels like last year. You know, you, you're you're onto something there, Lou. It definitely does feel like last year. It feels like 2017 all over again. And there was nothing wrong with 2017. 2017 was a great year. I had very little problems with that year. There we are. There we are. There's our city we're looking for. Silly octave, you missed. Ha ha. Oh, these octaves, though. Not sure I'm looking forward to this. Ah, Mifa! Hey, James Rogner, how's it going? Man, no wonder everything's going so poor for me. I don't even have a leaf. I don't even have a leaf. How, how can I expect to be just awesome without a leaf? Saw that boat and realized I don't have the thing that needs the boat, you know? Oh, and I'm getting all these like, what's going on YouTube? What's going on? Uh, all these, all these notifications from YouTube. Man, I don't know if you guys have had the same thing happen, but my YouTube notifications have been like really poorly out of date. Like I just got stuff from Kenny the Neo Kid starting his stream at, like nine hours ago. Oh, oh, here we go. There's a shrine nearby. It might be that one that I saw, like, way off in the distance. <laughs> if I had to guess. Oh, last you checked, Matt. Me no, Matt did not make me burn the leaf. I burned the, the leaf um, on the other save in, in honor of Matt. Matter of fact, uh, on the, the save file that we burned the leaf, we actually managed to put that as the, uh, the thumbnail, if I recall correctly. All right. So, two things. One, we've made it here. The Miyamagana Shrine. I gotta remember what this one is. Yes, the puns are bad, guys. The puns are real. All right. So let's see what's down here. What horrible thing have we forgotten about? Because we haven't done any of these shrines in forever. And for those of you that are joining in, my name is Mag Synchro with Convertible Turtle Gaming. Family-friendly stream. We are playing Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Um, oh, is this just one of those? Oh, it's this one. Okay. One second. Actually, wait. Right there. That should do it. Oh, thank you, opponents. That one's not annoying. Um... Funny enough, when the first time I ever played the game on my own, this particular shrine, that was the solution I come up with. 
was just to forget about trying to do it the way they want to do it. And that's, that is one of the things about puzzle solving in Breath of the Wild that is a common thing, guys, is the developers wanted creativity when they did this game. The Master Mode just today or until we complete the game. Gaming Keep, this is Supporter Saturday. Our supporters once a month get to come together and suggest games and vote on what they would like to see me play. And this particular game is what they come up with. So this is going to be every Saturday this month. And if they decide to vote for it again next month, it'll be every Saturday that month. Hey, Sally, good morning to you. Just start a new playthrough after a five-month break. It's amazing how much you forgot. I do not disagree. Uh, what's more amazing is how much I remember. As far as a muscle point of view. All right. So let's uh let's let's not fall to our to our yeah this time. All right, get this chest. Frenetic bow. Our inventory is full because we have zero Koroks. Now something that I have been thinking about doing for this particular playthrough is to not do the Koroks until last. I don't know if I'm gonna actually care for that in the grand scheme of things or not. But, you know, it, it is what it is. Uh, man, I really don't like having to drop the vinyl bow, but it's about to break, so we might as well just drop it anyways. And lark mode at work. Okay, Sally, no worries, no worries. All right, so... think I don't think there's any other chest here let's check uh, we got we got the shrine already okay so cancel back out there we go engaging work mode of all my emojis I've made recently I, I still like that one a lot I, I had fun making that one I still got to make some more but uh We'll figure out what we make. All right, examine. Give me my orb. Senior Gear Tropico, hey, how's it going? How is it going, man? Spirit Orb, yay, we have five now. Five, oh my gosh, we can start changing them. No Karox means no Hetsu Dance. Not true, Sue, because we have the other save file. We have the other save file, and so what we always do when we come to master mode is we load up the normal mode, and that way, because we have no Korok Man, so we need to get Korok Man in here, too. I'm doing good, Sally. I'm doing good. It's a uh, much, much nicer, nicer day uh, at work last night. Oh, say you're good tropical. Uh, no need to thank me on that, uh, or just... At, or say you know anything along those lines. I was not the uh, the designer of this particular happy stream series. It's all up to the supporters. Um, they got to vote. They chose a couple games. They chose Pokemon Quest and Breath of the Wild. They voted on them, and Breath of the Wild won by a landslide. Uh, it was like eight to one. Uh, really awesome, awesome vote pull out there. All right, so. I guess I need to go over here and like remove this pin because that was in the wrong spot. It, you know, it was it was almost in the right spot. But yeah. Oh yeah, it was a total landslide. It was a very decisive victory. Very decisive victory. But if you go back on this particular stream, you can see at the very very beginning I pulled a, a little fast one on everybody. All right. So we got the we got this there. All right. Post that. <laughs> oh, I'm glad. I'm glad it's in your good tropical. Uh, you can talk. Yes, I can hear you. Da da da. Oh, what do you steal from me? Some stamina, because you can't go less than three hearts in the game. Oh, 
no, 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 no. I hit the wrong button. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, okay. That's going to cost me. It's going to cost me. All right. We got to we got to give him that back. Yes, please. Yes. I want to surrender a heart container. Yes. Give me a hundred rupees for my heart. Alright. You have one of your essences so far. I want one back. I would like a stamina vessel. Yes. Alright. You guys gotta remember, I am halfway asleep sometimes when I come home, though. Alright, uh, what am I still doing here? I ask myself that all the time, really creepy statue. Alright, so... Now we're just going to uh, do some really quick traveling. We're going to pick up four hearts. We're just going to hop, skip, and jump to those. Come back and turn them all into stamina. And then we're going to pop over... To all these shrines, because we have all these shrines just kind of, you know, peppered around the world. Things that we hit while we're on our, our tear to go kill Ganon. So we can get a little bit further along the, the tracks here. And this is going to be a really kind of weird playthrough, guys. Because unlike the original Breakfast of the Wild... Huh, interesting. Was not aware of that opponent's. Yep, 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 yep. Thank you, thank you. We're going to go really, really quickly here. Got to find that heart fast because our, our, our bow is about to light on fire. I know that for a fact. Where's the heart? Where's the heart? Where's the heart? There's the heart. Grab the heart. Uh, yes, this is... Um, well, it's been a, an option for a while, opponents. Like, back in January, uh, when we last touched this save file, we were told that that was something we could do if we ever picked it up again. And so... Uh, it's been a feature for a while. It's just, I, you know, during the, the Master Mode challenge, it was, we couldn't even pick them up originally. But since part of the 100% Master Mode completion that we'll be aiming for as we do these on Saturdays, talking about the game as a whole, uh, yeah, it's actually been available for a while. Um... All right, so we got one, two, three. Here's the fourth one. You'd think it's possible in the other... Oh, you mean in the series as a whole. Um, not true. In the original Legend of Zelda, the original, the OG, Zelda number one, you could go back to the boss rooms and pick the hearts up. Because there was a really, and I do mean this in the craziest sense, there was a crazy uh, challenge, and you can do in the original old school gold Nintendo cartridge. So if you got one of those fancy schmancy Nintendo classics, you can absolutely uh, try it there. Or if you've got this one here, the OG gold cart, uh, you can do what's called a swordless three heart challenge now let me tell you swordless three heart challenge is no joke no joke uh, but it is something you can do uh, you basically play through the game you do not get the sword from the old man at the very very beginning and you do not pick up any of the hearts in the game 
it is it's really really challenging uh three heart challenge on the original zelda is not that difficult um the only drawback in both the three heart challenge and the north sword challenge is you cannot defeat ganon um in that challenge because ganon and it's really really dumb uh, but in the original Zelda game, in the original Legend of Zelda, you had to hit Ganon with the Master Sword to kill him. Which, you know, it made for an epic moment, right? You had to find the Master Sword to kill Ganon. You had to have the Silver Arrows to stun him. So there were two weapons you had to have to kill him. Uh, silver arrows, of course, now are called the arrows of light. Yes, I came here to tamper. Yes, uh, we're in the mood to sell. We want to sell you a heart. Hey, game master, it's been a while. Yeah, it's all good. guys so now we're gonna pay him oodles and oodles I want one back stamina yep 120 So what's really interesting here, uh, if you think about this, right? Here's this, here's this, uh, we'll call it a, oh, guys, look what I see. Look what I see. I know someone there knows what that is. See here, it's been a while since I've. Yep. Oh yeah, absolutely. Hey, Mortal Hawk, how's it going? Gotta love that. It's it's been a while since we had that. Time for all the enemies' respawns. Yes, yes, all the respawns. But there's ways that we can cheese it, but we're not going to be cheesing it. We're going to go ahead and. Uh, can I not teleport to that shrine? I just discovered it. I never actually. Oh, that's the quest one. I discovered that one. Shawarvo Shrine. Don't remember what all that one's about. Here's a shrine test we can go do, though. Zelda's... Oh, James Prager, man. That's kind of crass. Family-friendly channel, man. By the Lionel... Oh, no, opponents. Not yet. Not yet. I am so out of practice. I'm not even sure I'm going to be able to fight the Guardians in this thing. That's not to say we won't give it a shot, though. Thank you, Sally. Really appreciate that. Pushing power, all right.
How'd you get Nightbot on YouTube? Uh, Game Master, you just sign up for it. <laughs> He's totally free. Uh, Nightbot.tv is the website to sign up. All right, and I don't think that's magnetic. Nope. Okay. Hmm. Hate this shrine. Never the same solution twice. Uh, you know, it's it's a little weird. Hey, cool cucumber. Let's see here. All right. So we do know that we need to sort of freeze there. Only sense still in this picture of the gears turning max head hat. <laughs> Got a gaming PC and it's awesome. That's cool, cucumber. You know, PCs are you know, I I prefer playing on a PC personally. Uh, but that's just my my personal preference, so it is as it should be. Um Alright, and whoops, that's the wrong button. We're gonna put one right here. I think we're ready to unstick this thing, but I couldn't swear it. So, all right. Uh, oh wait, almost ready. So let's see here. Um. We are. There we are. Oops, wrong button. <laughs> ah, there we go. And this is why. And there we go. All right. So the next question is, there's a chest. Oh, it's over there. That's ah, not that hard to get to. Of course, there are several different ways to go about getting this. Um, there's the other method that you could do, guys, is you could actually put a bomb on this side, this corner, and it'll actually lift that ball over here, and then you could actually just roll it down this ramp. And it will it will hop this gap um, if you put uh, if you hit stasis at the end and inspect it a little bit, and then you can actually roll it, and it's it's a tight fit, but you can roll it down this way too. Uh, I think that's all the yep, that's all the stuff in this one though. All right, sweet. Okay. 
and examine. Do do do. We're on a pretty good roll today, guys. We picked up four hearts. We got two shrines down. Um, getting back used to the controls. Clearly, there's a few things that I don't remember all the way. Like which button stasis is things. But my puzzle solving skills aren't too bad right now. Not too horrible. Now, of course, part of me needs to go and get all these towers. Like the lightning tower on master mode is going to be just horrible. Not looking forward to anything like that. Alright, so we got that one done. Let's go to the Moakit Shrine. See what this one has. I know there's several of the Turtle Club members right now with bated breath waiting for me to go into a test of strength. Test of strength, Mag. Test of strength with your shield and your Lionel sword. And your three hearts. Thanks to the GG opponents. Stealth tip. It's harder to hear footsteps. Hey, Victoria, no worries. We don't take attendance or anything. We're, we're you know, we're chill. We're laid back. We're, we're all good. Metal makes a path. All right. This is the Magnesis one. We run over here. We get ready to grab this one. Timing is a little bit on the everything side. Boop. Okay. Hadoken. Uh, maybe not. Hadoken. Um. Went Breath of the Wild and bought the expansion. Took you ever to get to the bike? Uh, you know, Breath of the Wild is one of those one of those games, man. But could Breath of the Wild end up being voted for next month? Oh, uh, yeah. Opponents, it's not going to be one of those things that gets pushed away. Um, that would be kind of rude to do that just because of a game being already done once. All right, let's just do that. Alright, so... the only chest here no there's gonna be no chest okay all right so da -da -da, da -da -da.
there's that, there's that. Because we got the path, we got all that shut down. Now we just got to go and remember where the other chest is. I want to say the other chest is metal. Some are dangerous. Oh, if that fell on me and killed me. I know, opponents. I am, I am aware that when we play Zelda, it is very much like NASCAR. People come here to watch me triumph over things and die. <laughs> All right, so let's see. Nothing there. There's the ball. Oh, that's right. There's the other chest. Hey, Posh, how's it going, buddy? Oops, wrong button. Hat Mag is happy. Yes, any day that you can explode something is a good day. Did I forget how to shield surf? All right, there we go. Ah, you know, I'm bored. Let's do that real quick. See, so the thing that I'm disappointed about this game, still to this day, if I see any kind of slope like that, I think I should be able to shield surf it. All right, so third shrine, third completion. Almost got to where we got a shrine coming up to where we can change them all over. question is, should we? I mean, how cool would it be, Turtle Club, to have like 120 shrines, 120 spirit orbs? I, you know, 132 shrines, 132 spirit orbs. You know, that'd be kind of cool. Alrighty, so... Um, just keep kind of carving up that side. We got to run for cover quick, though, on this one. All right. If you use a fiery attack against an icy wind enemy, yes. Quick, before I burst into flames. Personally, wait until you can do five upgrades in one go and add a bit of a challenge. Uh, I, I, you know, I'm not 100% concerned with a lot of this. I mean, I am concerned with things like Lionels, right? I mean, those are going to be a problem. Uh, swinging flames. Clearly, they're like wanting me to, you know, set fire to the thing, but I didn't really need to, right? Not there, at least. I don't think, which is part of my problem. <laughs> Not thinking is what gets me into trouble sometimes, guys. We all know this. Ah, see right there's the hmm.
Oh, tilt controls, how I've missed you. Alright. Require being super stealthy and patient. Um, yeah. I could see that. Your inventory is full. Ah. Boulder Breaker is not a Stone Smasher. Um. Ah. Uh, I. I. I'm almost broken here, guys. Ah! Hey, Hoenn, how's it? It's going pretty good, man. It's going pretty good. Um, let's pull out this broadsword and go fight this dude. That is the dreaded message. Oh, that hurt. No, that's a that's a more of a dreaded message in my opinion. Oh. And it happened, guys. It happened. So, are you playing to where you can get the master what? Bucks of the Wild, when are you ending the Oh, live stream ends at 9, Game Master. This is a one-hour stream on Saturdays, guys. Getting back to our roots. Uh, yeah, we're going to we're gonna have to sell all the hearts to get the Master Sword. All right. Yes. People who are supporters on the Discord are able to choose and vote. And let's be a little bit more meaner here, shall we? Okay. All right. That's that's. Hmm. So, and both have more bomb arrows and regular arrows. Ah, that's cool. I I tend to have whatever is helpful, <laughs> and uh, so far that's becoming a problem. All right. Yeah. Let's see here. Here we go. Throw the bomb, blow the bomb, get the barrel. We got this thing down. Um, you know, it's not so much that even. It's if if I the combat's the big problem for me right now. Hmm. Let's just stick with this weapon for right now.
Ah. Ah, and he got me again. You can parry those beams to shoot at you back with them, or you're not wanting to break your shield. I can, I can parry. I can parry. As I say it, never mind. <laughs> yeah, I can parry him. It's just, uh, it's just getting back in the groove, guys. I knew the first combaty shrine we come to was going to give us a little bit of a problem. Straight up, leave a shrine if they're in there. Well, Victoria, you know that's not a bad tactic. Sometimes the the best tactic is to not fight at all. Um, inventory full, and this is how tired I am, guys. How many times have we had that happen? Already have had that happen. Nope. Oh, not what I was thinking was going to happen. All right, Game Master, have a good one, man. good ah so nice to see you playing this game again though I uh, don't disagree I don't disagree if, if I were <laughs> if the death count weren't already up to four in the first hour I'd be a little bit bit happier a bit uh You know, it is what it is. What we should do right tomorrow, I do not know, opponents. I do not know. Yeah, it's, it's awfully close to time for head to dance, guys. So we'll, uh, this will probably be our last attempt for this shrine here. And if we don't get it, then we will save, we will exit. Let's, uh... Hmm. Gotta stick of autocorrect and grab your computer. Ah, uh, you know, that's not a bad thing. Either posh, the... All right. Maybe you leave the guardian alone. Ah, uh, not going to happen actually because they're they're nearby where we have to go for 100% completion. So. What we need to do is we need to stop getting hurt by this guy. as much. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Let's see. This ought to help. Downgrade, so we'll leave that be. Save and exit, you'll tell me back tomorrow morning. Try again. Oh, no, nah, man. Not tomorrow morning. But we do need to save.
Thought that would work. Oh no. How oh, we we don't need to stream tomorrow on this channel, man. Oh, right in the key, right in the kisser. Oh, again in the kisser. Ah, this is not good. All right, but unlike other confrontations we've had so far, we actually have the ability. Here we go. It's like deadly pong, sorta. There we go. Just had to get my distance. Oh, uh, maybe not. Alright. Alright, so we got that. We got that. Open the chest. We can tell that Mag is tired. Oh, yeah. Oh, I've, I've been tired for a little bit of opponents, but I've been looking forward to playing this. Does Majora's Mask have any abilities? Uh, it does, Victoria. Um, lesser enemies will think that I'm one of them. So, not 100% abilities, but, you know, some. Alright, let's see here. Magnesis. Stand on this. I guess we shoot this one. Actually, hold up. This can be Magnesis too, can it? Are you playing Breath of the Wild? Uh, yes, that's what the uh, that's what the game is, man. Breath of the Wild, Legend of Zelda. Awesome game. Came out yeah, last year. Won all of the awards. For lack of a better way to say it all. I mean, if there was an award to win, this game won it. Make sure not to exploit myself. Um, Not... A bad piece of advice for me. Oh, that's that chest that we still haven't opened yet. Okay. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Victoria, it, uh, it won uh, Game of the Year. It won non-Sony Game of the Year for, for PlayStation. I mean, you know, Sony actually has an award. Did, was that somewhere I needed to get up to? Did, I, I bet I needed to. All right. Uh, all right, so... Uh, yeah, I may want to say that's a good point, Posh. Okay. So I want to try that again. So we're going to do this. Let that run through. Can we get up there? Can we? Can we? Ah. Hey, Charlie Johansson, how's it going? Ah. No, like, no, nothing up there. Okay. So, all we got to do now, basically, is use the key. And that opens this room. And we can do 
this. Oh, of course. All right, no worries. We got this. All right, so there's one last chest that we have to open. And it's this one here in this room. And this is the one thing that we always wind up having to explain to people, right? So we can't loot this because we have not enough room in our inventory. So when we go on our actual map, look, the shrine actually doesn't say that we've gotten all the items out of it. And that's the weird thing, right? Is we clearly just opened that chest. The game should acknowledge, but it doesn't. So we're going to just throw this guardian sword away. Then open this. Uh, not really the spy. Um, that's going to be a waste of resources. Um. Alright, so now we can take the stone smasher. So, we still have our guardian sword. Alright. Hey, Danny, how's it going? So now we got the, now we got the chest emblem. And that's what we were looking for, so. But yeah. But yeah, man, if you can simply take something out with a with a standard arrow or a bomb or anything, you want to. Um, and it's a good mindset to get into, especially because of the later stages of the game. Uh, Guardian Sword is stronger than Stone Smasher. Uh, Stone Smasher is actually stronger per se. But the fact that it's a, a single-handed weapon, which means you can actually use it with a shield, is super important. Super important. But yeah, guys, we're going to get the shrine here. So that's going to be our fourth shrine for the day. Uh, one shrine every 15 minutes. I think it's a good pace to start off with. Now, granted, we're simply teleporting to these shrines. So, you know, your mileage may vary. Yes, I know, guys. Everybody's ready for the broccoli dance. But first, let's teleport out of here and go to Shawavo Shrine before our things burst into flames. Broccoli dancing, you're going back to bed. Ho ho and broccoli dancing, I'm going to bed, man. Ha posh, breaking out the old broccoli dance emoji. The dance of the double broccoli floret. <laughs> Alright, so now we're in a safe spot. We are going to save. This actually gives us a good jump for next Saturday, guys. When we go to Breakfast of the Wild. Second course. And we're going back to the title screen. Cannot use Hetsu yet because you're not a sponsor yet. I understand. I understand, Posh. There's no worries with that, man. So we're going to switch over to normal mode. Continue. Look at that, guys. Last time we fired this bad boy up here was April. I get hyped for the broccoli dance, guys. Look at that completed save file. We have four spirit orbs on this file, but we never even turned in. Um, how silly and odd is that? We must cherish this moment. Oh, Hoenn. Don't worry, man. It'll be back. 
He'll be back next Saturday. Kyoruk Shrine, Korak Man in flight. And of course, next Monday, guys, this Monday coming, we will be back with Majora's Morning Muffin, which is another Legend of Zelda game. We have the dreaded shooting gallery. I wish I could use this controller with its wonderful tilt controls, but unfortunately not. I completed this one. Yes, the spy. This game has been completed. Been a tradition on this channel since we got everything done uh, is to, at the end of a Breath of the Wild stream, to talk to Shakakala Hetsu do the broccoli dance and here we go guys bam <laughs> da, 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 da. that's one down oh soon we will we will we'll do the bow stash dance party bam yes Double yes. Did we like his dance? Did we like his dance? We sure did. We sure did. And shield stash. We had 100 plus streams of Breath of the Wild. Yes, we did. And there is the last of the dances, unfortunately, guys, which means that it is time for us to say goodbye. But fear not, because we will be back. Once again, all right. Uh, wait, is that that's our that's our village, right? Lorland, yeah, yeah. All right. All the memories, yes, absolutely the memories. Speaking of which, we will have to unlock all those again on Breath of the Wild. Oh, absolutely, Hobbs. Time for Mag and Link to go to bed. For opponents to go to work. Time for everyone to have a good whatever they're about to have, guys. I'm also going to have myself a good night. I know somewhere this game keeps record of how many times we, uh, well, that's clearly not where we're supposed to be fast traveling to. <laughs> oh, tired mag is tired. Lorlin Village is, Lorlin Village is where we love to live, guys, right on the beach. Minus the, uh, you know, water in the air and sunburns. You'll be back Monday. All right, Posh. Well, guys, tomorrow, of course, is Sunday, which is the Unshelled Day, which means we will be playing Okami in the morning. Digrat may or may not be playing her stream, but at 10 p.m. tomorrow night, we will be doing what's called Fortnite Every Fortnite, where we play Fortnite Save the World with our community members. All righty, and we are coming back here, guys. Korok Man, having had his fun, is now going to burn through that. Some of that little extra yellow wheel we've had forever. And we'll be sleeping, guys. Sleep till morning. Link always goes to bed and wakes up in the morning. Unlike me, where I go to bed in the morning and wake up in the evening. Yep, there's an auto save that happens, but we always save even if we don't know for certain what we're getting ourselves into. Well, guys, that has been the Supporter Saturday Breath of the Wild. I'm going to have a good night. You all have a good morning, a good weekend, a good breakfast, lunch, or dinner. Whatever you're about to do, guys, this is Magazine Synchro with Convertible Turtle Gaming saying have a good one, and thanks for watching. Take care.